Cabinet has directed its members to take a lead when it comes to the following up on the recommendations of the execution and development budget for NDP4. The decision was taken during an extraordinary cabinet meeting that took place recently. The Minister of Information, Communication and Technology, Chekero Tuea, said that the cabinet took note of the eighth progress report of the fourth national development plan requires that you need now to report back to the public what was achieved and what was not achieved, that before you come with a new one, that you can account why either you repeat the same thing that you said you're going to do and not did. Many a times, if you don't keep track with this, people would always uh, overestimate because they know they don't need to work hard. Cabinet also approved the integral national performance framework. There is that belief and said because the government is to provide that policy, we do it alone and then only give the final product to the public. So if it involves the public, it only makes sense at one point to also involve the public because it is their policy. Other decisions that were taken include the amendment of Property Valuators Profession Act of 2012, the proposed Uniform Matrimonial Property Regime Bill, Anti-Corruption Commission Strategy and Action Plan for 2016 to 2019, and the guidelines for the structure of the public policy document.